Hi, I'm Scott. Today I'm going to show you how we put shiplap on this island on a dad it yourself. Hey, good morning, folks. So here's the project for today. Got a kitchen island here, and the homeowner would like shiplap. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, country chic. So what we're going to do is we're going to skin both ends and this front with shiplap from the Home Depot. And it should be a relatively quick project and easy. Uh, my material cost was only about 180 bucks. So let's get started on this. So I have my first uh, rail cut and that's to length. Um, because this is a cabinet, there's really no structure behind here. So I'm going to put some pin nails in the corners and put it in with construction adhesive to hold it. And then I'm going to do the two end caps with the little cutout for the toe kick there. All right, let's do that. So for these end rails, I had to route out the end of this to compensate for this little edge right here and then cut out the toe kick. Okay, so I have all the rails and styles installed. As you can see, I cut that little groove right here. We'll just clean that up with some painter's caulk, but I got a nice little reveal right there as well. Now time to do the field boards.
Okay, the last step I have here is this shoe molding. So I spent about $100 in materials on this and it took me about four hours to do. An easy project that any homeowner can do. And for those of you who follow my channel, you know I don't paint, so this still needs a coat of paint. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, put those down below. Speak in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you subscribe, hit that bell for notification. I've got some videos over here you may be interested in, and the subscribe button's right down there. Thanks for watching. Data yourself.